Nej. <laughs> Beautiful morning. Good morning everybody, it's about 8-ish or something, we're about there, 8.30. Uh, we're on the deep blue, as you'd expect, we're with Kerry. Uh, we've got Danny here, we've got a new fella Rusty who watches my videos. So we're going to get in there, we're going to hopefully smash some fish. We're at a spot I haven't been to, there's a hell of a lot of sign on the sounder. A lot of sign on the sounder. Um, so yeah, we'll get in there. Yeah! Bibazels, eh? This is pretty good. There's a keg right here, Daddy. Whoa. Shot, shoot one. Come over here. As I pull this up, shoot one of the kegs. Thank <laughs> you. 
no, it's doing it again. Okay, spot number two for the day. Uh, it's, it's actually been relatively tough so far. The kingfish dried up at the last spot. Um, pinkies and all that were hard to get onto, but apparently the water's really clear where we are now. So we're obviously getting back in. And um, I'd like to shoot a couple more fish. Nice, nice. Uh, Righty ho, everybody. It is 4.36 Saturday evening. It's dark for some reason. Um, probably because it's winter. We had a good day in the water. We found quite a few fish. We I had a good little bit of shark interaction. Um, we've come back with a couple kingies. So second shot. I think there's a clip of me second shooting Kerry's fish, which I actually ran out of line, so that was down at like 20. And it was just a piss poor shot because the back of my gun was being pulled on by the line, but we landed that one. Um, yeah, we've got a lot of fish to prepare. A couple, I think we've got four good sized coeys as well. Um, Danny shot one, so that's her first coey, and I think it was a bit of a stonker. So, pretty much through the last part of this video, is we're going to just fill up fish. We'll probably, probably do three different raw fish meals which we might as well include we're going to do just a plain old sashimi we're going to do a kakonda and we're also going to do a poke yeah. okay so our fish factory tonight's fish factory is well underway just gonna fry a couple little pieces of this up just some kingfish um, we got big kingfish loins here. Got a kakonda that's about to sort of get underway. Danny's just cubed the fish. Um, oh, we've got a giant Tupperware in there. What else we got? We got some poke. Danny's done a Hawaiian styled poke, which is beautiful. Um, we're gonna do some, some sashimi. We got some in the freezer. We've 
we've got a lot. We're going to eat a lot of fish this week. It's going to be good. We've got some wings in here. Did I say that before? I don't know. I felt like I was missing something. I almost burnt my face off before too. That was cool. <laughs> Absolutely superb. Mmm. Too good. So on tonight's Kingfish Kakonda menu, we've got a, a preparing a very good one here. Um, we've got red cabbage, we've got cucumber, tomato, which I'm cutting right now. Uh, what else have we got in there? Capsicum. Uh, spring onion, some parsley, uh, really hot chilli, um, and I'm even going to dice up a couple of jalapenos which we haven't tried before, a little bit of salt and pepper, hell of a good feed. When you like jalapenos, and you got a Gilmore's card, you eat jalapenos. So we're going to have a fair bit of heat in this. Going to be beautiful. Here's the big bowl of kingfish. Slice these up. And of course some coconut milk. Cup of tea. For when you're old and it's 8 o'clock and you're about to go to bed. In she goes. Yeah. Hmm. Do we need more? Whoa. Oh. Okay, wrap it up from a solid day. Brilliant day in the water all around. We had probably, wow, close to 20 metres vis today. I could see Curious Kingfish down there at a stretch right of 20 metres. So um, that's it was pretty much epic all around. We got a good haul of fish finally again. It's actually been a little while. Really going to eat some good quality fish this week. Um, That's it really, same as usual. On Over on the main channel I'm working on a couple of projects, a Raglan Thundercat video and then I'm going to be documenting gun builds and skimboard builds and things like that because people actually seem to enjoy them and um, just keep on keeping on. Um, yeah, cheers for the guys today, Danny in the water. Um, that's it, I'm Sam Price, I'll see you at the beach.